We're in this lovely restaurant yes. because I'm going to give you a starter main course and dessert in human form. At the end of your three courses, I'd like you to pick a favorite for a possible sequel. Who knows? I see. Are you apprehensive? Not in the slightest. Was there ever any doubt? First on Mark's menu, it's movie and video game developer Alessio. I'm an illustrator concept designer. I am extremely cheeky, classy, and sometimes I can be a little bit naughty. Cheers. Sounds right up, Marky boy, Strada. Hello. Ciao. Ciao, mm -hmm. sei italiano? Sì. Come ti chiami? Alessio. Mark. Molto piacere. Piacere. This is like a live action Dolmio advert. The wonderful thing about speaking a foreign language is that it brings out a different side to your personality. So this is kind of great. You sound like you're from Milan. No, I'm not from Milan. London? Yeah, <laughs> exactly. No, I am from London. I was born here. Chelsea. What about you? I'm from Sicily. I go around Sicily every year. I do the whole island. Tormina. No, I do it by boat. The most inland I go is Noto. Oh, and wow. I'm not crazy about Noto. Yeah, what would you? I don't know, but everyone's obsessed with it. Everyone I know is getting married in Noto. <laughs> yeah, I know. That's exactly how I it's feel. It's like getting, getting married in Newport. What would you do there? Thank you. <laughs> oh my god, someone who understands. <laughs> so what made you leave Italy? I used to be a professional singer. I wanted to be an opera singer when I was very young. <clears throat> nice. But I wasn't good enough. And now I'm a full-time artist. No, really. Music, art, culture, short sleeve shirt. We'll gloss over that. What's your medium? In video games, mostly, and films. Okay. I'm the owner of my studio. That's so interesting. Shall we cheers? Good health. Salute. Salute. Well, hello. Looks like the conversation's going down just as nicely as the vino. Hello. Hello. Nice oh. to meet you. How do you do? I'm Mark. I'm Alex. Oh, I love that you've um, matched your brim to your bag. Thank you very much. That's quite something. Thank you. To make an effort. And obviously, yeah. I knew I was coming to meet you, so... So, the brim matches the bag, but does the collar match the cuffs? What colour are his pubes? It is curious that he should have elected to match the brim of his hat to his fanny pack or, or, or handbag or whatever you want to call it. Cross shoulder. And the... It's a lot of... But he is wearing long sleeves, so that's that. Are you an artist? Um, no, I do data analytics. Oh! It is good. So what does it entail? Looking at a lot of data and analysing it. Look at his face, hasn't got a clue. Do you have to make those, 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 um... Big fish, little fish, cardboard box? Internet, the, the computer things. What do you mean? Yes, on a computer, Mark. Not file effects, whatever you're still using. The ones with all the boxes. I'm not sure I follow her. <sighs> Spreadsheets. Yes. Yeah, oh, my God, you make those. <gasps> yeah, I do lots of things to do with that. Wow. Calm down, Mark. He's not like he said he wears a cape and fights crime at night. Batman. Pivot tables and stuff like that. What's a pivot table? <laughs> I'll show you one day. <laughs> oh, my God. Ooh, will you now, Alex? Is it something yeah, so that it's pivots? got data that Evidently. can be manipulated easily. And... Do you like manipulating data? Yeah, it's good. I'm sure Alex is perfectly pleasant. And whilst manipulation is definitely my thing, it's probably not when it's data that I'm in no way interested in. So, do you think it would be possible to rewind and go back to my Italian starter, please? Dessert is looking pretty sweet, y'all, yeah. So tell me about you. You must be a model. I am. I've been modeling for about eight years now. Yeah, it's a big passion of mine that I've always loved doing. Well, I say, Shanae has walked in here with a lot of confidence. What a pudding. <laughs> So who are you modelling for? I've done, like, Puma before. I've done a McDonald's ad as well. Like, that was ages ago. I've done one, too. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? Get free McDonald's, babe. You can't go wrong, They wouldn't you? give me one. They took me for lobster instead. Oh, that's even better, babe. <laughs> Typical Chelsea. Even the McDonald's do look lobster burgers. I went there once mm -hmm. at 6 o'clock in the morning, and I asked <laughs> the lady for a recommendation or what mm -hmm. the special was. Mm -hmm. And she refused to serve me because she said that I didn't understand the product. I'm like, 
Do well, not judge a book by its cover, yeah, exactly. but by the way, you're absolutely right. You're See right. you later. Thank you. Or never. And I'm sure whichever staff member refused to serve him was named Employee of the Month soon after. I guess we won't be doing any more McDonald's Hello. advertisements. <laughs> <laughs> Fast food has always been a favoured topic of conversation. Somehow I can see this being a fast turnaround. So what do you prefer, like, men or women? I think it really depends on the person who's in front of you, you know? We're living in a moment in which people are expressing themselves so much more openly that I think you've got to be kind of open-minded and go with the flow. No, absolutely. I, I, I hear the I... comforting music of hushed tones. Yes, we were whispering. Janae. Yes? This is the end of nay, Mark's... Nay. Three course meal. <laughs> it was so nice it to was meet you. Long. I had the best time. I loved this evening's efficiency. Bang, bang, bang. But my gosh, this decision is going to be nail biting business. You have a very tough decision, Mark, because we have Sinead, Alex, and Alessio, but you can only pick one to enjoy a second date with tomorrow night. There's no room for error. I'm not going on another diabolical appointment. My favorite course has always been the one that is easiest to share. So who's it gonna be? The singing Italian, the dirty guy, or the Mackie D model? And you know, I really, really need to practice my Italian, so Alessio, would you like to meet again? Certo. Does that mean no thanks, bruv? Of course. Ah, bellissimo, diavolo, linguini. I'm looking forward to seeing Mark again on, on our second date, and hopefully it will progress even further. I chose Alessio because Italians are great because they have good taste, on the whole. I know I'm generalizing, but they love to live, and that is paramount. So that's a date booked in for Mark Francis and Alessio. I'll give McDonald's a ring, see if I can get you a reservation. McLobster Mills for two. I think this beckons for a group hug. Oh, do you think so? I think so.